Cuckoo's here, Carrie Maletto. Yeah. Uh, this, uh, it's so holiday now that you're here. Oh, thank because you. Because we are gonna make the coolest fun things. I love this company. Holstein is such a great yeah. company. They make all wonderful products. This is called our mini cupcake maker. For $20, let me tell you, you cannot have more fun with your kids ever than ever. making mini cupcakes or brownies or whatever it is you're gonna make in it. Sure. This is such a compact, cool little device. It's easy to clean. It comes yes. in great colors. And it even comes with a fun little bag. It comes with a matching bag, oh, which I think goodness. is so much fun. So I wanna show you that first so that okay, you understand. Go ahead. Go ahead, not go only, so the only choice you have is which color do you want. So we've done a nice blue here that actually comes with this bag that you see here. So the blue is the poke, like the, the dots. Then over here we have the owl. So it's an orange maker with the owls going throughout. And then over here is the pink maker, which actually comes with like, it's almost like a chevron design that you have. So whichever one you're choosing comes with a matching case, which I absolutely love. So that way when you store it, or if you yeah. want to bring it to the family's house, you know, uh -huh. maybe for the holidays, you're going to want to bake some cupcakes, but it really comes down to what it does. Look at so how cute for, those are. You know, for only $19.95, you're getting the ability to make these absolutely Absolutely adorable mini treats and they come out perfect every time because all you do with our Holstein makers is you plug them in and within two minutes you are ready to bake and when you pull Look, out your treats that's the cutest little thing <laughs> you've ever seen in your life so think I want you to think about how much you're going to be entertaining over the next month and a half, two months, Correct. right? Correct, yes. Even if it's like Valentine's Day, you want to make little mini cupcakes for, for, your, for your sweetie pie, you can do stuff like that. Look at how easy this is. So you can spoon it in. I'm using our <laughs> batter bottles, which we do have at Holstein, um, so you can check that out at some point. I don't know if we have them right now, but I'm sure we'll get them back. But the big thing is that you can pour right in or you can spoon it in. It's non-stick top and bottom, and that means even if you miss a little bit or it runs over, not a problem. It's going to actually just peel right out at the end and Look you saw how I took treats out and yeah. then just put some right back in <clears throat> because it's non-stick everything just comes right out so right here I'm just going to go ahead and close yeah. it we're going to come back in literally four or five minutes that's <laughs> all it really takes and we're going to have some treats ready to go again so now we're going to come down to this is our pink maker so if you're looking at the pink maker it's kind of like a hot pink color we did chocolate in this one oh so gosh. yum 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 and you know it doesn't matter what type of mix that you use you can use a mix from box mix right you can make your own mix. My husband is gluten-free. Sure. So for that reason, I need to use gluten-free um, ingredients. <clears throat> if you have someone who has uh, uh, issues with sugar, sure. um, issues with any type of specific uh, allergies, this is great to be able to make treats in a Could matter I, of minutes and, yeah. and not have to worry. And I could put little brownie stuff in there if I wanted to do different types of things. You can do that as well. The batter, it's designed for the batter. Is, uh, but if you want to go easy, yeah. you can even get little, you know, the, even little sweet rolls from the store and you can pop them in. This will this will bake them up nice. Nice. It's so much fun to be able to have this kind of simplicity and ease. And also, you know what? It's a lot tidier than when you normally do stuff with your kids. Exactly, you know I mean? right? It's easy to clean, which I think is hugely important. And you're able to bake fast. So yeah. I think if you're trying to teach your kids or grandkids how to get involved in the kitchen, yeah. I think this is the best way to do it. Love because it. it's something that you can do. You just simply close it. It has a little lock at the feature at the front that a just closes ready it. ready light on top. The little ready light on top just yeah. tells you after two minutes when it's nice and ready to go. And then when you're done, you unplug it, you wipe it down, and it stores nice and easy. This can be something that creates an activity when everyone's hanging out for the holidays as well. Snowy day, rainy day. Exactly. Yeah. So if you want to be inside, you just go ahead and put out like a little bar of uh, decorative ingredients. So if you want to do uh, sprinkles or mm -hmm. you want to do different icings, always let your cupcakes or your muffins or whatever cool for a few minutes. That's why you haven't yeah. seen me decorating yet because as I'm pulling these out, they are definitely very hot. hot. So you want to let them cool. Otherwise, the icing's just going to roll R right off. How long do they take to cook inside? They're about... So Here. it depends on which batter you're using. Yeah. The thicker your batter, you want to up the minutes. But I'd say approximately five to seven minutes That's is great. usually what Quick. it takes. Okay, so keep yeah. an eye on them. But um, whenever I'm using like a, um, I'm going to do, look at this. Here's one idea. So I'm going to do chocolate in that one. I'm going to do strawberry I here. I smell the strawberry. It smells so amazing. So we'll do strawberry this way. You can do different flavors. You can even put sprinkles or chocolate chips or different ingredients inside them as they bake. Okay. So if you wanted to do like maybe even a cherry in the center or something like that, I mean, you can really have fun with this. And again, we're always looking for activities and ways to include the family and doing things together in yeah. the kitchen. So that's what I think is so cool it's about something like this. such a way to like connect this. with your little ones, you know, Absolutely. especially. And, and boy, if your grandparents out there right now and you've got... Uh, 
and I don't care how the old they are. My kid's 15 years old, and he'd be glued to this dang thing. Yeah. He'd be like, when are we eating cupcakes, bro? That's what he'd be <laughs> saying to me. And here's the other nice thing is that, you know, unlike regular baking, which can take 35, 40 minutes to get something to, to cook, you're doing it in about five minutes, and you'll watch us do them live. You can have little decorating parties, if you'd like, mm -hmm. um, where you can go and get pre-made you know, pre icing and things like mm -hmm. that, sprinkles, all that great stuff. And look at how adorable these are. You know what else is nice, too, is you're not committed to the whole dang cupcake, which for many of us is you know, prohibited uh, against yeah. our d various dietary restrictions. Yeah. But surely you can have one of those little mini cupcakes, right? Yes, you there's could. Probably, there's no calories in there. That's right. We don't even count them. <laughs> no, exactly. nothing in there. But it is about portion control. And you know, if you've noticed, if you go into a lot of bakeries lately, it's yeah. all about the small dessert. And right. you end up paying size. so yeah. much money for them, actually. But you can make them at home. You're seeing mm -hmm. how easy we're doing it. And then I want you to think about other things you can do with these as well. So you can cook. We've done muffins in this one. So we yeah, do that's what I was curious yeah. about. So other types of cornbread. doughs can go in there. You can do cornbread muffins. So if you're doing chilies could, and stews this time of year. Could I do that thing year? I said before, like get the little... Uh, the little um you know little what am I, little sticky bun dough that you buy yeah. and just roll it up and put it in there Absolutely. could you do that too because it's sweet rolls you know what i'm exactly. talking about exactly yeah. oh my gosh i just jumped right out okay um, because you could also do like maybe like little egg cute egg souffles you could do um so many different things because again this is simply a non-stick cooker top and bottom so all you want to make sure is that whatever you're putting in it has the ability to rise right um because that's what you're actually doing in here so it's anything you would potentially put in your oven and this one look i'm just going to use a spoon so you'll see I'm actually on purpose I want to get a little bit of it kind of a little all over okay it's so it's non-stick right it's non-stick and the reason I want you to see that is because then I want to show you how easy it is to clean up afterwards so if you're thinking about doing this with the kids and you go oh well Carrie did it perfect on the first few right. you know I'm never going to be able to do it that perfect don't worry about it even if it's the kids doing it this is going to just simply peel right out at yeah. the end because for me I've always said this a hundred times if something doesn't clean up easy I I don't care how cool it is. I'll use mm -hmm. it once and then it goes in the cabinet and I never I, take it out again. I'm so on board right? with that. And I'll, I'll give you an example. Yesterday I was cooking uh, this big baked dish that I do and I have I have a huge ca cast iron pan and yeah. it's lined and it it used to say that it was it wasn't that hard, difficult to clean it's a pain to clean it's like literally almost steel and so when wall. you have the option so using I that use or something else I use my nonstick one I'm like it's just so it. much it. it's so much easier yeah. and, I, and I usually love that kind of cooker but it's like literally you're scrubbing forever and most <laughs> a lot of people can't even do that anymore you know if you get to yeah. certain age you can't scrub those pots and pans precisely so and, and if I'm talking to grandmas out Ooh. there you're doing this with your kids literally wipe it out with a wet cloth I mean, that's essentially what you're doing. You don't stick it in a dishwasher or nothing. Mm -hmm. You're just wiping it out. That's all you do. Look at those pretty little cakes Look you made how there. Fun. So again, you could create like a little section and a little area where everyone's decorating and you're actually putting on, you know, your little holiday sprinkles and maybe your favorite, you know, um, different icings. And we're actually going to have a recipe book that's going to come with this that'll have not only some recipes on how to make the cupcakes, but also mm -hmm. on how to make the icings. Don't forget, these are coming with the matching carry I love the cakes. Bags. So what happens is these zip all the way around. You're actually going to put your maker inside when you're done using it and this can tote. So if you're going to go to the family's house, if you're going over you know grandma's house if you're mm -hmm. going over friend's house whatever it is and I know we keep saying this is kind of for the kiddos but I'll tell you what if you're a baker and you just oh. want to pop out some mini cupcakes yeah. fast this is the way to well, do it have can, this in your cabinet if you can do six of them how many can you do seven at a time is that how many we can so, do so yes you're gonna do what you think yes, yes. Look at, oh good this did this so, perfect. so you could do seven at a time and we just put those in about five we or six just minutes put these ago in. you saw me put these so, in so think Look about it. that so in an hour you know you can make 20 times that amount right it's five minutes times no i wouldn't what did i say so you have to do five times whatever to get you 60 minutes you know what I'm yes about. i know but it just goes so yeah. fast so right? anyway you can make a whole boatload of these things in an hour so if you needed yes, you to can. go quick and you needed them done and cooled fast and you were a baker a point being you're right you you would use these look at how great Absolutely. they came out and look i wanted to show you see how it kind of went over a little bit no problem you see how it peeled right out now this could be just like your little fixing that you're just eating snack. along the way <laughs> I just eat that. <laughs> Nothing goes to waste mm -hmm. with them. But what's great again is even though there was a little run over and these again came out completely perfect top and bottom. I don't have to worry about look them. Look I don't need them. to check on them. This was only a few minutes. And when they're out, I can go and do another batch again immediately because look at, look at the inside yeah. completely ready to fill again so you fill a couple of those and I'll do a couple of these All right. and again it's just a fun activity to do and the most important thing yes it's portion control but also it's about 
activities with family. So you're having that opportunity to spend some time with the kids and the grandkids. If you're thinking about a gift and you say, I just don't know what to get my right. grandson, my granddaughter, my, you know, I don't know what to do. This is really fun to buy for a family for something they can do together. And for the price, this is like the perfect, it's 20, like it's $20. Anyone you know who loves baking, this is the way this, to do it and hand them this because they will use this. Imagine That's what bringing I think is this fabulous. As, a, as an office gift for somebody, a little secret Santa gift and you could make, know. you could make little cornbreads in the morning. In five minutes, you can make little mini muffins for people in the morning. I love that idea. You could do protein muffins. Little I mean, tiny it, egg souffle. Little, yeah, yes. morning, you're oh, sitting at work. It. All you need to do when you get up for work is just throw some eggs into a shaker, yeah. bring them in, and you can make egg white omelets or whatever. Little mini ones. And four or five of these is enough for breakfast. That's all you would need. So what the heck, right? Yes, exactly. It's really a great way for a $20 bill to get it. We also did it on Holiday 4 Flex. It's only $4.99. Oh. We just put those in. Look, look at that. Remember, those are the ones we just did. I look, love look, it. Look, look. Let me see. Are they all finished? Do you need a minute? Let's they're, see. No, they're perfect. They're actually, look yep, at, all done. Look inside. All done. Here's my hands. Oh, there you go. I just that. opened it up. It's nice and hot. It's perfectly. Oh, my gosh, look at the steam. Yeah, it's perfectly cooked. So that I always use a little awesome. spatula or a little something just to pop them out in there. And, um, you know, what's perfect, again, is that it's fast, it's easy, and for me, it's nothing's more important than the fact that, A, I'm controlling and I know what ingredients I'm putting in here, but also that it's so look at how easy perfect, to clean. Look at how perfect that's cooked right there. I want you look to look at, at the golden, perfect yeah. color. You'd be hard-pressed to do that in the oven, and with regular muffins, it'd be almost impossible to get that kind of look. Let me tell you, baking is a pretty precise science, so if you're not, like, if you don't use the exact certain right. ingredients, you don't get the temperature exactly right, you don't, you don't have to worry about that with this. You literally plug it in, and two minutes, all you do is take whatever batter you want to use. So if this was just a box batter that all you need to add is maybe some oil, some water, stir it up, you're ready to go. And when you fill this in, just fill it in, like, right around yeah. that fill point of the circle if you're wondering it how much to over, put. It goes over, don't worry. And if it goes over, we went you way over on the first one, and it's actually fine. It'll clean right it'll up. It'll clean right up. <laughs> it'll come way off. And then it's just like I showed you with the chocolate. It's really easy. It just pull, you know. So right there, we went over. I'm not worried about it. I'm going to close this because of the fact that you see the top and bottom is going to close it, and it's going to make those muffins absolutely perfect. Come here. What? Come on over here. <laughs> this is the one that we overfilled. Oh, stop it. <laughs> He's like, we overfilled it, but we I want to show you something. This because is fun. if you are sloppy like maybe we were in the beginning, you I want to show up. you something. You can't look, mess up. Look. <laughs> That's actually kind of cool. I actually think I created right. something I want to try. Look and at that. And then with a towel. Look at that. Are you kidding me, man? And they will all peel look right at. out. So they'll all peel right out and still be and perfect muffins. look at muffin. how clean. And we, all we need to do is just wipe around the edges. Yep. That's it. So just so you know, it is very forgiving. <laughs> You're going to love this. I'm telling you, you, oh, will have a, you will have the time of your life using this product. I know we are extremely busy. I have 600 people in the ordering process. There. It's only $4.99 to get it home. Try it till the end of the of January. 30 yeah. day unconditional money back guarantee till the end of January. Yep. Have fun with your kids. Have fun. Make your little Christmas cupcakes. You'll love oh, it. I mean